Why do I look flushed out? Mm. I don't know why I look. Oh, the sun, the sun is shifting. Okay. All right, so my lighting is changing. We're gonna work it out, people. We're gonna work it out. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for tuning in for another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome, and don't forget to subscribe. If you have already been a subscriber, welcome back. So for those tuning in for the first time that may not know what a natural hair moment is, basically these are videos, educational videos that are five minutes or less, and I basically just give you the definition of a word or phrase that is commonly used in the natural hair community. I'm gonna be sharing with you guys another natural hair moment. This natural hair moment is all about the word co-wash. Now I have to admit, I never heard of the word co-wash until after I went natural. Before I was natural, never heard of it, mentioned, never seen it, nada. Once I went natural and started learning more about natural hair and terminologies and phrases, that's when I heard about the word co-wash. And believe it or not, there are still some natural people out there that just have never heard of the word before and or they just don't know what co-washing is if they have heard of the word. So what is co-washing? Co-washing is a method of washing your hair using only conditioner. Co-washing your hair is something that I honestly would recommend, especially if your hair is severely dry and matted and very tangled and just very kinked up. I would highly suggest and highly recommend co-washing your hair using a conditioner only to start your washing process. It makes the washing process so much easier because it lessens the breakage, it lessens the snapping of your hair, you're pulling out your hair. Sometimes if you're using a shampoo that has sulfates in it or has harsh chemicals in it and you go right into washing your hair without softening your hair with a conditioner first, it will be a drastic mess on your head. Trust me, I've been there. It will be an absolute train wreck on your hair, especially if you're trying to grow your hair and keep your hair healthy. You do not want to start in with a shampoo. I highly suggest and recommend co-washing. Use conditioners that are sulfate free, that are paraben free, that are very moisturizing, very hydrating. Co-washing your hair also keeps your hair more moisturized and more conditioned, and it also helps to keep your hair more manageable when you're detangling your hair and again diving right into the shampoo sometimes can be very harsh on your hair and it does make the detangling and the manageability of your hair very difficult so just to give you an example of some conditioners that you can use for your co-wash these are a few of some of the ones that I use this is from texture ID this is the three-time moisture cream and my all-time favorite this is from herbal essence the hello hydration this is from vo5 this is the strawberries and cream conditioner Another great co-wash I will recommend is from the As I Am line, which is the Coconut Co-wash. This is the cleansing cream. That one is really great. I've already run through mine, so I don't have um, another jar, but I'll probably be getting one in the future sometime. I don't know, but that's a really great one as well, so check it out. Also, there's co-wash products from Shea Moisture, Carol's Daughter, and my all-time favorite, Eden Body Works. So the next time you hear the word co-wash, you'll know what it means and you'll also know how to implement it in your next wash day routine. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and to help me grow my channel. It's just Janine. I will see you guys on the next video. Bye guys. Bye.